Let's say if we have pain in our elbow, for example, right? Let's say we have pain in our elbow, and we pray for it one time, and nothing happened, and like, oh, forget it, you know, like, and you give up. Does that take you, are you continuing to stay in believing? Actually, let me back up a little bit. So when you have pain, and you decide to pray for it, what category does that put you in, believing or unbelieving? Believing. Believing. So that's the state that will guarantee you a blessing, get you a result, correct? So let's say the next day you continue praying for your elbow. Where does that put you? Believing. Let's say on the third day you continue, where does that put you? And then somebody tells you, just forget about it. Like that's, that's, your, you know, that's your life. You're just going to have to deal with it. And then you stop praying. Where does that put you? I'm believing. When you switch back to unbelieving, is anything going to change with your elbow? No. No. So I'm using a a simple example, but I just want us to understand that principle. Now, most likely, a person's not going to try to talk us out of it. Now, sometimes some people will, but who will try to talk us out of it? The devil. Who does the devil sound like? He sounds like us. So... You're going to think that you're talking yourself into it, not realizing that the devil's talking yourself out of it. And so this is where it's so important. If you choose to believe, you, st- you continue believing until you see the result. And you don't stop until you get that result. And according to the scripture, Jesus said you will be blessed. So if we use the example of the elbow... So at what point will you be blessed? No. No, at what point do you start seeing the blessing, I guess? Yes. So when your elbow is healed, that's when you're blessed. Okay? I'm just trying to make it very practical, right? So I want people to start seeing what's written and don't just scan through it but to have a visual understanding of how you practically apply this. So this is, this is what I do in my life. This is how I practice it. So I want to share with people what, what I've learned, um, and it's been working. So blessing is the end result. And so what that means is you believe until you see. And the blessing is the seeing part. So if, you continue, if you're continuing to pray for your elbow and you see the end result of it healed, that's when you saw your blessing. That's what believing will cause as the end result, is that blessing, is that healing. And so now I want everybody to see the things in your life that don't line up with Jesus and make a decision to start standing on that and not believe one day and believe, not believe the other day, believe one day and not believe the other day, but be consistent. Stay in that believing until you get the end result. Yes. 